Ah, there it is. Lightning just pretty much struck the Lich Tower again. I'm not staying hopeful. I, I don't like that that's happening. What is going on you guys? My name is CPK and welcome back to another episode of CuteCraft, the cutest SMP on the internet. And guys, I'm starting this video with some bad news. In the last episode, you saw me go to the Twilight Forest and find a Lich Tower. That Lich Tower had already been defeated by Scott the Great. The issue is that I actually recorded 25 minutes of my episode yesterday before going to bed. And uh, what happened there was I sent it to my editor and my editor said, by the way, Callum, do you know that your audio has no audio? So I had to uh, wake up to that message and realize, yes, I had lost 30 minutes of progression. And some of it was straight fire too. Like, it was good content. And that's gone. So we're restarting. Today we're going to be trying to take on a Lich Tower, which I have found already. I've already found a Lich Tower. But I'm also going to be trying something funky. I'm going to try and take my Sfig. Is this even a Sfig? What's this called? Flying Cow. Okay, much simpler name. I'm going to try and take my Flying Cow to the Twilight Forest. I don't know if this is going to work. I have absolutely no idea. I'm guessing that's a no. It would have been so nice to have this guy there. It really would. Like, look at me. I can just fly around. I'm going to try again. Please let him in. It's not going to let him in. Right, let's put him at home. Clearly, we are not allowed to fly in the Twilight Forest. So now the only problem is that the place where I found... I'll show you on the map. The place where I found this new Lich Tower... Uh, I have a death somewhere. Uh, yeah, here's my death. Okay, so it's right here. The issue is I can't just go straight there because I literally have to run through loads of areas that I can't go through yet and they damage me. So I've got to go a really weird way around. So this is my big issue now, and especially because it's raining too. There's a, a certain place I've got to go through that's like acid rain. If I can't see it, then I will likely die to it. Uh, I think it's there, so I've got to try and go around. Now, this is the previous Lich Tower. This is the first one we ever found. So, uh, we know for a fact this one's already been done. So, there's no need to worry about that. Right. Is there any need? Stop! Right. I need to get myself a shield. ASAP. The storm is wild. So, I've actually been in the Lich Tower. I got absolutely destroyed by everything. There was just so many mobs that I literally just got killed by, like, skeletons and zombies and stuff like that. I have no shame in admitting that. I brought my white apples because I don't remember what they did. Uh, I remember them doing something, but I didn't want to waste one. So we're going to find out when we get there what the white apples do again. And I'm also going to kill as many deer as possible on the way because they give me yummy venison. Even if it is raw venison, it's still good to eat. Don't judge me. I feel like the fact there's a giant thunderstorm is pretty ominous, to say the least. So... I'm not holding out hope for doing this Lich Tower because it just seems like everything is stacked against me. I don't know if I'm going to be able to do it at all. We are getting to a point where you should almost be able to see it on the horizon, though. It is just in front of us at this point. So hopefully it pops up any second. And the, if the storm could stop too, that would be really nice. That's just to make me feel better. I don't know about you. I hate storms. Ah, there it is. Lightning just pretty much struck the Lich Tower again. I'm not staying hopeful. I, I don't like that that's happening. So honestly, I think I'm going to build up and work my way down. I tried to go in from the bottom and there were just so many mob spawners that it's actually unreal. The issue is, if it wasn't such a long run back, I wouldn't mind dying. But it is. It is quite a lengthy run back to here. So I don't really want to keep dying. What I want to do is just run in and get rid of the uh, spawners. But that's easier said than done. I definitely made an entrance. I've been in here. I think it's this side. Yes, there it is. So I've been in here. There was a zombie in particular who... Did I bring my torches? Oh my god, I brought no torches. Am I serious? Why am I like this? Why am I like this? I'm just going to quickly check all the rooms I've been in. Just to see if any of them have torches in. I don't think they do though, or else I'd have, I'd have probably had them already. I'll take the torches back from these rooms. It doesn't really matter if things spawn up there now, if I'm not going in there. Glistening melon? What? I'll take it. I will take it. Let's take the sugar too. That looks jazzy. Is that rare? I don't know if that's rare or not. I'm going to leave the golden sword because I don't really ever think I'll use it. But that's pretty cool. Thanks, game. I actually did bring a bow. So I can kind of deal with them a little better than I could before. They're all on that bridge. That's the problem. I'm just going to go in for the spawner instead. Okay, we got the skeleton spawner. That's fantastic news. 
There's another one right there, though. Get away. Oh. I'm just going to go in for it again. Ooh. Okay. That's good. Are they going to be on every single bridge? Because if so, that might get a teeny bit stressful. I guess I could do it how I did it last time. I said this time with... Hey. Who shot that? Who shot that at me? Ooh. It's spooky and dark. This is my new strategy now. Ooh. Hi, bud. Hello there. Oh, God. The skeletons are coming. Uh, okay, good. Good. Well handled. Good job, me. A chest. Please have torches. No. The glistening melon is great, and I appreciate a gas tier. Okay, we'll take that. Okay, I'm up another floor. I'm just looking for things to have, please. If you have any things I could have, that would be great. What tower is this lich person in? Oh god, he's what the heck? Where are you, where are you flying down from? The hell is that? What the hell is that? A death tome? Why is there a flying book? What is going on? Power and projectile. Hey, that's pretty good. Right, what's this white apple do? Let's find out again. Well, that's not good at all. What has that done? I just can't. I just can't see. It's just made my vision go green. Oh boy. I guess in these books probably mean I'm getting closer, right? Stop. I just the spawner. I just wanted the spawner. I got the spawner. I got the spawner. Ow. Sir. Please stop. Why is there an Enderman? What is this place? I hate it here. I have no beef with you, Enderman. No beef at all. Just leave me alone. And I'll leave you alone. I'm guessing this guy's going to be up there, right? I can actually see up here, so that's much better. Ah, that, that, that'll be it. That'll be it. Oh, God. And, and what's this like here? How, how, how does this... How much damage do they do? Okay, I can't I can't hit that person. Do I have to hit you? Oh, Jesus. Okay, I can't hit you. Ow. Interesting. Huh. I'm going to have a potion of regen. And then I'm going to go back in there. I can't hit them. Okay, I need to learn about them a little, I think. Do I need to kill the tome? Ow. Huh, okay. I should probably look into how to kill them first. Let me do that, because I am uh, lost. Okay, so after doing a tiny, tiny bit of research, I found out now that I uh, have to hit back the things that he fires at me. The ender pearls. I have to hit them back towards him. Uh, which... Ow. But if I miss, they hit me. And that's not good. Oh, I am actually damaged in there, though. You can see. Ow. Guys, I'm going to need more time than that to hit them. Jesus. Are you serious? I was trying to get a potion of regen. No. Oh, I've got to run back again. I'm going to weep. Okay, but at least we know how to do it now. Let's run back. I'm going on an adventure. Okay, guess who's back? Back again. Callum's back. Tell your friends. I am back at Lich Tower. As you can see, the Twilight Lich is on half HP. Because I have been doing some reading up, I do know that he has three form. Oh, he sounds mad. He has three forms, so he's going to take a lot longer to kill than... Oh, why are you here? Stop. I also did find a bunch of coal on the way. So I made some more torches so I can get up safely. Because we like a lit castle. Because the castle is lit when I am in it. Haha, -ha, I'm so hip and down with the kids. We are woke. We're almost back up at the top. Hey, look, there's my potion of regen I was going to eat. I can take potion of fire resistance as well. Just in case... That helps with the uh, explosion stuff. I don't know if it does or not, but we're going to find out. Nearly got me. Okay, go, go, get up. Okay, here we go. Here we go. I'm feeling good. No, I'm not feeling good. Those ones, it's those little extra ones that are annoying. 
Okay, that didn't... Again, I didn't hit it somehow. I somehow managed to not hit that. Ow! Please stop. This thing is so strong. I have one more regen potion left. So I've got to hit those things back at him. But the, all the other ones throw them as well. So it can be really hard to hit them back. Oh, that one hit him. That one hit him. That one hit him. Okay, good, good, good. I'm just going to dodge them unless it's a really easy shot. Okay, this should be an easy shot. No! no. The one at the back hit the one in the front! Nope, that missed. That missed. Okay. Here we go. This is it. This is it. This is it. We got it. We got it. We got it. No, we don't got it. Ah, Jesus! What are you doing? Don't come downstairs. You can't do that. Or can you? Can I hit you now? Fire a fireball at me. <gasps> there we go. Okay. So now I can hit him. Because he has zombies. But he can spawn zombies until the scepter runs out. So we just got to keep hitting him for now. Ow, Jesus. He can still do that as well. I didn't know that. The issue is that after this... Oh, yeah. I got the phoenix bow with me just in case this came up. So I'm glad it did. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. I'm stuck in a corner. Ow. Okay. Now he's got... Now he's on his normal thing. The scepter is gone. Now he's just going to hit me for nine over and over again. But I've got him on slowness. So I'm actually able to do this. If I just eat up and then pot up. Because... Oh, God. He's in the corner with me. Ah! Get away. Arrow. Arrow. Yes. Die. Die. Oh. And someone's at the door. That's perfect timing. Let's look at the loot in one second. All right. Now we're going to take a look at what we got here. Because let me tell you, the postman didn't have anything interesting. What staff did we get? The zombie scepter. Or ah! Ooh, ooh. What is going on here? Get off. That's a zombie chicken riding. That's a zombie riding a regular chicken. I thought they had to ride zombie chickens. Would you die, please? What the hell? Okay, so as you can see, I, can I kind of got lucky. When he spawned all the zombies, for some reason they spawned underneath me instead of above. And uh, now I have the advantage of being able to take them all out as they come upstairs. So when I was fighting the Twilight Lich there, he had a zombie scepter. For some reason, only two or three were spawning upstairs. The rest were spawning underneath. So it made it much easier for me to kill him. So I'll take it. I'm not going to complain at all. There are a lot of you guys. Oh, good God. Oh, they actually couldn't get up. They were getting stuck. Okay, what is going on? Are they all, they're all spawning from in there. Oh. Okay, now I'm stuck in here myself. This was maybe a bad choice. Okay, let's take a look at what else there was. It looked like he dropped some other stuff. So, we got the zombie scepter. Nice. Nine charges left. I don't want to waste those. Let's get, look at this guy sneaking upstairs. Go away. No one likes you. Uh, we also got the Twilight Lich trophy, which is great. That's what we wanted. Some unbreaking and fire protection golden leggings times two. Uh, so overall, that's actually a pretty good loot. It wasn't too hard to kill him. Um, after you get past the first part, it actually wasn't that bad. The rest of it was pretty, uh, pretty easy. So the next area that we're now allowed in is the Twilight Swamp. I don't actually think it's somewhere I've really come across, to be honest. I'm going to elegantly glide back down this tower like the angel that I am. And try and work out what the Twilight Swamp is. And inside the Twilight Swamp, we will find labyrinths. And in the labyrinths, we'll find minnow shrooms, which are like Minotaur-based bosses, I believe. Uh, so, I forgot I can zoom down. I don't have to float so elegantly. And freedom! Hello, world! Okay, so if I maybe run this way for a few minutes, see if I can bump into any swamps. Oh, apparently I'm looking for a place that has mangroves in it. Like a swampy mangrove area. That's interesting. Okay, so... I could head out here. Oh, that's a lot of water. Well, wait. I actually did find a swampy mangrove area before, right? Didn't I? Where was that? I'm sure I remember finding one. Okay, so guys, I'm going to leave this episode here. Thank you so much for watching. By the next episode, I will have found a twilight swamp. That's my plan. Uh, hopefully you enjoyed this one and us taking down the lich. If you did, make sure to leave a like, leave a comment, and subscribe if you are new. I have been CPK. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you guys next time. Peace.